This is the JVSN Media Network broadcasting worldwide. Thank you very much, Jenna Green. Good day, YouTube viewers. Jeff here with you, but it's great to be back with you here in the JVSN Sports Cards and Autographs YouTube channel once again. Thank you for stopping by on your YouTube journey. If you're brand new to the channel, I welcome you aboard. Appreciate the opportunity. And if you're returning back to the channel, once again, I appreciate you returning. As you can see in today's video, my friends, we're going to be opening up another blaster box of the 2022 Panini Prism WWE Training Cards. You see Roman Reigns and Becky Lynch on the cover of the box here. This is the debut edition. We're going to look for blaster exclusive green pulls are prisms. Your breakdown is up top here. Four cards per pack, six pack and all for 24 cards. We'll come over here to the side of the box here for the breakdown of the randomly inserted. It's a 200 card set with 100 base horizontal and 100 base vertical. We can find uh, cards numbered down to 10 in here. We can find autographs in here as well. We're going to see if we can find any of those here today. We are going to find green pulsars and I probably one silver as well. Non-base fall to one in every pack. Production date is on the bottom from March of 2022. And over here it says we are to look for the blaster exclusive green pulsars along with the silver prisms. And we're looking for retail exclusive autograph parallels. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get started on this. Let's bring in the March of Dimes duck here for a squeeze. See if that'll bring us some luck here today. Let's go ahead and crack this baby open. I do appreciate you all stopping by the channel here today to check this out. We very much appreciate it. So we've opened a few of these, quite a few of these on the channel. Found this one at a local antique shop, much like I did with the basketball mega box I did recently, the Flux. I found it at the same location. Uh, they were running a sale on this one as well, so... Got this for about $14, which I think is a, a decent price for this. We'll go ahead and close the box up. We'll shuffle up our packs here. And then we're going to go for it. Of course, as you all know, we're looking for the big hits here today. We're looking to get to the Warner Circle and hopefully find an autograph in here. Wish me luck, everybody. I have all my supplies on hand, including one touch in case we hit something significant out of here. Let's go. So we're going to go through these here. There's Guraj on the rookie to start it off on the horizontal. Kofi Kingston, part of the New Day. We've got Lacey Evans, who's no longer with the company. And our first insert card is going to be a Fearless of Rey Mysterio Jr. Not a bad one to pull right there. Let's continue on to the next pack. So, looking forward. Uh, I know Leaf has a new product uh, coming out here. A new wrestling product that's got a lot of people talking who open, who open wrestling products. Looking forward to seeing that one. There's Ivar in the horizontal to start it off. We have Sonya Deville. James Drake, and behind that we got a Prismatic Entrance Insert card of Drew McIntyre. That's awesome. Definitely take that. Continue on. Let's see what we got here. There's Shayna Baszler getting the uh, armbar on uh, Naomi there. A lot of talk that maybe Naomi could be coming back to the WWE, maybe at the Royal Rumble. We'll have to wait and see on that. Behind that one, we've got Dusty Rhodes, the American Dream Dusty Rhodes, rest in peace. Jinder Mahal, who's recently been in the news uh, because he, uh, by the time this will be airing, uh, he will have had or will be having a, a title match with Seth Rollins on television here in early 2024. And behind that, we have a gold insert of AJ Styles, the phenomenal one who just recently came back. It's kind of a rogue character right now, kind of a, a tweener baby face and heel. Let's continue on to the next pack. Bobby Roode starts off the next pack, noted here as Robert Roode. Got a silver on the back, it looks like. Austin Theory is going to be the next card. Austin Theory uh, recently had a match on television with uh, Carmelo Hayes on SmackDown and um, looked, as, uh, looked like he just avoided almost a serious neck injury. It was a big spot there. I'm sure all of you wrestling fans have seen that by now. So thankfully, it looks like he's going to be okay. Roderick Strong, who's in AEW part of the Devil uh, storyline situation involving MJF and Adam Cole and all that. Our silver is going to be uh, a rookie of Emil, or male, I should say. Emil, male, on the silver rookie. Two packs left. Let's see what we have in here. Still looking for a green. We've not seen a green yet. John Cena, I don't know if anyone can see that card, but John Cena is our next card. We got a Primate, Rookie, I don't even think it's with the company anymore. Mandy Rose, who's no longer with the company. And then behind that, next level of Matt Riddle, who's no longer with the company. Matt Riddle on the next level. 
show you the back, not numbered. And we are down to the final pack of the break, folks. Again, thank you so much for checking us out. Me much appreciated. Let's see what our last pack has to offer us. Looks like we got a green pulsar on the back this time. There is Fabian Eichner right there, who is um, Giovanni Vinci right now. We've got Duke Hudson on the rookie. And behind him, Brock Lesnar. And our, our last card of the break is going to be a green pulsar. It is going to be of Akira Tozawa. So, not the most notable green Pulsar we could have pulled, but that's what we got here. So, uh, let's go ahead and just very quickly recap our key pulls out of here. Not a whole lot to speak of in this break. I'll show you the inserts. Next level of Matt Riddle. Gold insert of AJ Styles. Prismatic entrances of Drew McIntyre. Those are actually not too terribly bad. And then a Fearless of Rey Mysterio Jr. Our Silver was a rookie of a male. And our green Pulsar was of Akira Tozawa. So overall, this was not one of the stronger blasters, but that's what we got here today. Let me know in the comments section below if you've opened the 2022 Panini Prison WWE Train Cards. What your biggest pulls are. Love to read them in the comments section below. Be sure to keep your eyes on the channel for more breaks coming up. We have more wrestling to open up along with baseball, football, basketball, and much, much more. So be sure to keep your eyes on the channel for all that coming up. Thanks for checking out this Blast Boss Break of 2022 Panini Prism WWE Train Cards. Hope you enjoyed the video. Be sure to leave a like on the video, sub to the channel, hit the bell for future video notifications, and be sure to check out all my other wrestling breaks here on the YouTube channel. We'll see you the next time in the next break. Bye for now. For the JBSN Media Network, this is Jenna Green speaking.